What up, Bucks fans? This is Michael Plus of Real Bucks Talk. We are back with another video, and we're going to talk about uh, the Buccaneers signing safety from the Seattle Seahawks. Ryan Neal, as you see there on the screen, has agreed to a one-year deal, and he had a really good season last year. He's a safety that can be used in multiple ways, and that's something that the the Buccaneers are looking for, uh, you know, to add to their safety group and he's a guy who can come in play the nickel or he can play you know free safety strong safety he's got that kind of capability um, and you look at the deal they obviously got a lot of value um, as you see there he signed for the veteran salary deal um, so very minimal uh, salary and it's not going to cost a lot uh, for the Buccaneers to have him this season so with that said, again, it's a, a really good move. I think this is a move that sets the Bucks up for, you know, flexibility in the draft that's coming up, and it gives them a very legit piece to pair with uh, Antoine Winfield Jr. I know a lot of folks have been talking about maybe we're going to sign our, our draft Brian Branch, you know, at 19, and that very well could still be the case, but you know, getting a guy like this, he's got a legit size, as you see there, 6'3", over 200 pounds, um, and played very well last season for the Seattle Seahawks. Um, so again, it's a it's a very good move. Uh, I like the signing, very good value. And he's a guy that can come in and, you know, add value for us. Um, and as you see there, very good grade overall, 85.6 from PFF. He was one of the better safeties in the league. So that's awesome. Uh, so yeah, really good move on their behalf and got to like it. I think so far this offseason for the Bucks has been a very successful one, especially with the limited resources that they've had. Um, and adding a guy like this, as you see, put up pretty good numbers last year and still young, only 27 uh, years old, as you see there from Jordan Schultz. Uh, so yeah, really good move. I like it. I think it's going to add to our depth. Um, and he's a guy that can play special teams as well uh, and has, you know, very excited to come into a Todd Bowles defense where you can really use his skill set, you know, in the right ways and should be a lot of fun to see what he can offer um, in the defensive backfield. But let us let us know what you guys think of this move. I think it's a very good signing, and we got to see, obviously, see and let it play out. But got to like what he can bring to the table, and it just gives the Bucks more flexibility heading into the draft, and that's always good news. So be sure to hit that like button, comment down below your thoughts of this move, and with that said, until the next one.